Hello, and welcome to the JetBrains YouTube channel. The third season of our series begins with an overview of PHP Storm 2020.3 EAP1, which brings support for even more language features of the upcoming PHP 8. Notice that as soon as we opened the project, PHP Storm detected the language features used and automatically set the language level to PHP 8.0. With this new widget in the status bar, you can now instantly see the current language level and adjust it without going into preferences. We're now fully set up, so let's go through the most notable PHP 8 features. For better code readability, PHP Storm provides parameter hints for function arguments. In PHP 8, you can use named arguments for this purpose, which are supported on the language level. Inside the list of arguments, press Alt-Enter, select Add Name Identifiers, and switch to the new syntax in an instant. Notice that PHP Storm has highlighted a parameter that has its default value. With positional arguments, passing such parameters is required, but with named arguments, it's no longer needed, so we can safely remove them. Of course, PHP Storm provides code completion for argument names and warns you of any incorrect or mistyped parameter names. Prior to PHP 8, code metadata could only be specified in PHP doc comments, whose format was not validated and was not supported at the language level. With attribute support, metadata can be provided as full-fledged language constructs. To create an attribute, add an attribute marker on top of a regular class. After that, you can mark up your code with the created attribute. Of course, all the expected coding assistance features are in place, including highlighting, code completion, finding usages, refactorings, and others. PHP Storm will also help you make sure the attributes are used correctly. It will indicate whether the specified class can really be an attribute, whether this attribute can be repeated, that is, has the is repeatable flag, or whether this attribute is applied only in the allowed targets, such as a class or method. With constructor property promotion, you can avoid boilerplate code when initializing variables through a constructor. With PHP Storm, you can use a quick fix on a property to switch to the new syntax and back in no time. In addition, several new inspections will validate that promoted properties are used correctly. They will detect redeclared properties, properties of the disallowed callable type, variadic properties, properties declared outside the constructor, and properties declared inside an abstract constructor. PHP 8 introduces a new match expression as an alternative to switch. It has strict type safe comparison, does not require break statements, and can return a value. In PHP Storm, you can position the caret at a highlighted switch statement and use the provided quick fix to convert it to the new syntax. If the condition is never matched, PHP Storm highlights it as redundant and lets you remove it. If there are duplicate conditions, you can quickly navigate between them and remove either the whole arm or the condition you don't need. Identical bodies and different arms can be merged into one to save space. PHP Storm will check the condition type against the argument type and will warn you if there is a mismatch. For example, unhandled conditions will cause a fatal error, so you can use the add default match arm quick fix to deal with them. Since match expressions can only contain one default arm, PHP Storm will detect the duplicates too. Match expressions with a just single arm and a default arm can be safely replaced with a ternary expression. And if there's only the default arm, then the match expression might not be needed at all and can be simplified. In PHP 8, instead of null check conditions, you can now use a chain of calls with the new null safe operator. PHP Storm will check that the operator is used correctly. You can't use the null safe operator in write context or as a reference. In PHP 8, it is possible to catch exceptions without capturing them as variables. To remove a variable in a catch statement, you can use the Alt plus Enter quick fix. Throwing exceptions is now allowed in any context where an expression is accepted. For example, in arrow functions, the coalesce operator, and the ternary operator. To quickly add a throw expression, type THR and then press Tab to expand the live template. In earlier PHP versions, to get an FQN, you could do class name, class, but on objects, you had to call get class. In PHP 8, 
This behavior has been streamlined. You can use the quick fix to replace get class object with object class. PHP Storm will also warn if class is used inappropriately. PHP 8 introduces several handy functions for working with strings, and PHP Storm will assist you in converting your code to use them for better readability. Now, instead of using a generic strpos function, you can use the more specific strcontains function to check if a string contains a specific substring. PHP Storm will also highlight the sub str calls that can be replaced with the new, more self explanatory str starts with and str ends with alternatives in order to determine if a string starts or ends with a specific substring. This sums up the recent enhancements in the latest EAP build. Stay tuned for more updates, and thanks for watching.